Karibu mtazamaji tunamani hadi tamati mimi ni Mary Wekesa. Maafisa wa kliniki magharibi mwa Kenya wamepuzilia mbali ripoti kwamba wamerejea kazini wakisisitiza kuwa mgomo bado unaendelea huku wakitaka mwenyekiti wa baraza la magavana Anna Waiguru kuondolewa ofisini kwa kile wanachodai ni kushindwa kushughulikia matakwa yao. Mwana habari wetu Elizabeth Kisyangani na taarifa hiyo. Uh, today we are gathered here in the lakeside city of Kisumu uh, where the Nyanza and Western uh, caucus of the Kenya Union of Clinical Officers are here to make a statement and this statement we are making it to the public, to the county governments, to the national government and to our members. Ratification of the Clinical Officer Career Progression Scheme is essential for operational efficiency. Counties in Western and Nyanza have failed to employ, promote and resignate our members, affecting morale and exacerbating staff shortages. We commend, and this one should be, uh, should be taken very seriously, we commend the Governor of CIA James Orengo for supporting our ongoing strike. And we urge other governors to also do the same as we prioritize dialogue with the COG for CBA realization. We want to say that our strike persists and no force can deter us, no force, completely no force on earth, can stop us until our demands are met. Rumors of strike cessation in specific counties are false, null and void. Our strike is legally protected and attempts to obtain court orders by some eight county governors fell yesterday. We are also on the streets because of the UHC staff. The government of Kenya has already provided almost uh, 6 billion Kenyan shillings to convert the UHC staff, uh, where we have almost, uh, almost uh, a thousand clinical officers under the UHC, to be converted to P&P. &P. The, the money does not come from the county government. The money comes from the national government. It, is, it trickles down to the county. 